I was, grew up in Vermont, and um, you know, I, I'm basically wanting to get south, so you're not in, in six months of winter. And uh, so my, my aunt and uncle actually lived in Roanoke, and so we, we just picked Virginia and went towards it. So we went around, we visited Richmond, ODU, Radford, you name it. And um, actually, when I, when I got here, it was Thanksgiving break, and me and my father went on the football field, the old turf that gives you raspberries. Now, now that turf doesn't do that anymore. And it's why the gate's like wide open, and we're just throwing the football out there, and it was, um, it just always felt like a really like special home sort of place for me. And the campus blew me away. Uh, I had no idea it looked like that. And uh, I really, it was, it was just beautiful. And it, it, there was, it was a clear match for me when, when I, as soon as I stepped on campus, it just felt like home. I was really uh, taken back by the amount of people that said hello when you're walking around. And again, somebody you don't know, but these people are walking around and say, hey, how you doing? I just thought it was, it was a really nice place to be. Well, the first part of it is obviously Sean, um, you know, it's Sean's alma mater. So coming back to that, and I had visited a few times when we were in college, when we dated a couple years in college. And I, it just always felt nice when I came down here. Um, I never thought we'd be back here. So that was a nice surprise. And I remember when he had accepted the position with Kenny and I came the next weekend to get a feel for the area and you know see what it was like and I just loved it. It feels like home, that's the best way I can describe it. Um, when we first got here everyone was so welcoming, everyone's so warm and just so supportive. I mean everyone's just, it, it, it would have been a hard place for me to leave, I'll tell you that, <laughs> if we had to. I don't know, many people don't know this, but uh, I met my wife on the, I think the playground in first grade. Um, so, so we we've, we've been down a long road, um, but but you know what really helped me here was when I got her to come to Evansville with me, and we spent some time in Evansville, and the place never really clicked for her, and she had been to JMU a couple times to visit me, but um, really didn't know, and as soon as we moved here, and she trusted me to bring her here, she she loved it. I mean, she she never wants to leave, and it's. It's, it's the, the same landscape as in Vermont, where you got mountains and you got, you know, that sort of thing. Um, but she, she, she loves it. She just loves the community. I mean, she's, she, the relationship she's got with our neighbors and our neighborhood, I mean, she, she loves it here. And it, it's been special for me to go to school here. And then now I've got, I've got now a wife, I've got two kids that are, that are coming to Jamie football games and going to Jamie basketball games. I mean, that, I think that's like, one of the coolest full circles you can have. Um, and especially being as a part of the university as I am. And it's one thing to just move to Harrisonburg to be here to support JMU Athletics, but being involved. And the opportunity, you know, for your children, and when you think about your children, them being able to come and, and sit in a second row of a sporting event. I think not every kid gets to do that, you know? Um, even my, sis my sister has three, three kids and they, they they live for this. They live for Duke Dog. They live for I mean they like it's nonstop, you know. So um, that's been really special to me, and it's it is it is home for me, and it's always felt like that. And the best part is my wife feels the same way, and it's you know um, she's she's even Joe. We're, we're not I don't care what you what you're doing. We're we're not going anywhere. We're staying right in this house that I love right here. So um, so it's been it's been really special. It's nice. Um, Sean and I have talked about the important, importance of family. That that's always been huge in our core values, um, just in our relationship and um, everything we do together. We were both brought up in really strong families and big families. I mean, up in Vermont, you have you know your cousins, your grandparents, your aunts and uncles. Everyone is really close, and there are a lot of big family events. And since we grew up together, I was with his family a lot too, and vice versa. So. Um, it's nice to have, I mean, having my in-laws here is wonderful. I, I love them too, you know, they're, they're like parents to me too. Um, and having Kate's sister here with her kids, it's just been nice. So the family aspect, I think, for me is, you know, one of the, the most important things, just that it's really, it's really a part of us. And it, and it should be because it's so ingrained in his life too, and it's, it's fun.